been waiting for you, Dovahkiin. Of course, to me, your memories are an open tome. To begin with, I know you have trespassed countless times against others of your kind. And I know you have looted the corpses of those you have slain. I know you have used treacherous poisons to debilitate your enemies. I also know you have come from the future. And why is that? Is your desire for power so great that you would break even the laws of time for it? It makes no difference. You will not take it from me. You would not be so foolish as to break my law. I see the kind of person you are. My law is the only thing keeping you and your kind from descending into chaos. I mean, my law. I made it because your kind would be incapable of order, of peace, without it. That makes me the Arbiter. I am also the Founder. I discovered this site millennia ago, and the deposit of Ethereum beneath us. I laid the foundations, and I watched my children grow, and learn, and use the Ethereum to create marvels, technological wonders. But they grew quarrelsome and used their knowledge to create weapons to use against their own kind, and worse, their own father. So I confiscated their weapons and declared my law that each and every one of my children would live in perfect order, or they would not live at all. And here I am, millennia later, Still waiting for children worthy of this city. And for my patience, it seems my reward is a visit from you, Dovahkiin. Well, why have you traveled through time to come here? What is it you seek? Dabbler and sin come in here without a shred of reverence or humility and have the audacity to make demands of me? You will die.
come from? What are you talking about? I... You're right. I was. Uh, is that some kind of sorcerer? Uh, well, I don't want any trouble. Uh, let me get out of your way. We're not supposed to talk to new people till they see the yard. Oh, hello. My what? My, my story? Oh, do you want to hear about me? I'm sorry, but my memory's not very good. I only remember some things. I, um, I came here with my brother Horrible. He used to look after me, and he said he always would, but then he died. Now nobody looks after me. I, I'm not very good at remembering things. Sometimes I forget, so I need help. That's why I need some help finding Horrible's treasure. Oh, help. Horrible said I should only tell someone I trust. Only someone I know. Not you. I don't know you yet. Do I? Mm, uh, no, not yet. A way out? Oh, no, I, I can't leave. I need to find Horrible's treasure first. Oh. All right. There's a face I don't recognize. It's always exciting. Here's a key to the last vacant chambers down in the city, between Brawl and Luki. I sent you here. I... Well, it's... It, this is my... This, this... But that's odd. My letter makes no mention. So the dwarves' lore is real, after all. Just as we always suspected. But you know who broke it? Who was the culprit? You? But... why? What did you do? You just... gods! What is wrong with you? Well, it seems you've been given a second chance. I trust you won't make the same mistake again. Now, assuming you can control yourself this time, I need you to do a favor for me. I need you to investigate the city. You must work out who... As Yarl, I authorize you to go anywhere you need to go. I can't pro... And of course... It now what do you say? Will you help me? Thank you.
If it helped, goodbye for now, and good luck. Thank you so much. If there's ever anything my husband to be and I can do to help you, just ask. Hey, 
You're the one who killed all those bandits, aren't you? very precious in a secret chest. He hid it away just for me. I've asked the others for help, but they don't help me. The Yard even wrote me this letter, but I'm not very good with words. Here, do you... do you think you can read it for me? Tell me what, what it says. Right there. What is this one doing here? Ah, the locked chest. Yes, we have it, but have been unable to open it. Why don't you come in and join us for dinner? Very well, but hurry. We are hungry. My siblings and I, don't worry, we will all share in your company. We are explorers like you. We were exploring the bottom of a great mine when we found this cave. But just as we found it, the earth shook and the mine collapsed behind us. This is our home now. We are pleased to see someone in the flesh. So curious this one is. We have been here for years, surviving on fish and this wondrous mushroom, and whatever else we can scrounge up. Good, good. This one asks many questions. Now, let us eat, hmm? It is wise not to trust us, but the wise ones taste just the same as the foolish. 
It walks into our lair. Yeah. Quickly, let us eat it. Sisters, help me! 